Recently, I did a video on the divine feminine and divine masculine, and you guys really seem to enjoy that video. So, today I thought I would do a video on self-care products to get back to your divine feminine. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sarah and I help teach people how to find inner happiness through fitness and spirituality. And today, we're gonna dive into some feminine products that make me feel like a divine feminine queen. Now, this can mean all types of different things for different people and this doesn't mean it has to be a female that this is for. Everyone has a divine feminine, everyone has a divine masculine, and if you want to tap into that more femininity, say that three times fast, femininity, 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 what's that thing from Finding Nemo? <laughs> and it also doesn't mean you have to go spend an arm and a leg to get these things. These are just what helps me feel more calm and relaxed and more girly. So you really have to ask yourself like, what is it that makes you feel calm? What is it that makes you feel relaxed and like you're in your feminine flow and you feel kind of girly and you just feel kind of like a princess. And most of the products that I'm going to share with you guys today aren't things that I have always gotten or always bought, but they were things that I saw and I was like, let me give that a try and let me see if that makes me feel a little more feminine and girly and a lot of times they did. So let's hop right into it. The first thing I want to share with you guys has been something I've been doing for probably a decade and this doesn't necessarily mean it's going to work for you just like all of these products but I genuinely love having a spray tan and I do have one right now and it was one that I did at home and the reason is and I will do another video on this but I am recovering from COVID and I'm still in quarantine right now I still have another day after today and then I'm set free <laughs> but while I was home and having COVID and I didn't feel well for a few days you know, my nails are super grown in because I obviously couldn't go get them done. I just kind of felt like, like a little troll. And one day I woke up and I was like, you know what? I feel like feeling feminine today and I'm gonna put a spray tan on. Typically, I've been going to a tanning salon for years. I typically get a spray tan once every week, once every other week or so. But obviously, since I couldn't go, I wanted to use an at-home self-tanner that I used a lot during the big, quarantine that we all had uh, in 2020. So this product is called Loving Tan. It's the two hour express deep tan. And I seriously love this product. It literally made me feel from like a troll to a queen. <laughs> super easy to apply this is not a sponsored video I just genuinely do love this product and I've tried so many at-home tanning solutions and this one is definitely my favorite it's a foam and it comes out and a little goes a long way and the only thing about it is that it's a little hard to reach that that part of your back unless you're like super freakishly flexible <laughs> I always have my roommates help me out with that part but I love having a spray tan it just I don't know what it is about it, but it just makes me feel more polished and refreshed and feminine and honestly just a little more attractive. <laughs> the second product I want to talk to you guys about was a new one for me and I saw it, it was on sale, I was at Ulta and I'm just like, this looks interesting, why don't I give it a try? And it is a hair perfume. So this is what it looks like and it's literally all you do is like a kind of like a mist like you would on your body you just mm, holy crap it smells so good it's amazing and it just gives you it's kind of like um legally blonde where she spritzes her resume and her resume is pink and she says it just gives it a little something extra well that's what hair perfume does <laughs> and while i'm sitting here smiling i want to show you 
this, which is a the Too Faced Lip Plumper. And if you've never used a lip plumper before, I will put a little disclaimer in here that it has a little bit of a sting to it. <laughs> and it's not something that is, you know, not unbearable. I mean, I have a very low pain tolerance. And I would say that the first time you're just like, you're a little shocking. You're like, what is this? What it does is bring blood flow to your lips. So it gives you a little more of a natural color. Plus it'll make it just a little more plump. I'm not wearing it right now. Um, I will say too that if you have a partner, I have been told that if you don't have it completely dried in or rubbed off, it can hurt them too if you give them a little smooch. So be careful with this product, but it's amazing. I love it and it always makes me feel just a little more feminine. The next product I have for you, pretty much every female has this product and it is my purse. This is the one I'm using right now. It's Nine West. I absolutely love it. I think it's so beautiful. It's so classy. And honestly, I'm not a big fashionista or anything like that, but I do love having a very nice purse. I probably switch my purse out every like six months or so. I'm not super like anal retentive on it and I pretty much just use a bag until I can't really use it anymore. You can already see that it has some cracks in the leather here but um i always get purses on sale that's just the way i roll i probably got this for like 20 or 30 bucks boscoffs i love boscoffs <laughs> i'm a big thrift store shopper so get yourself a cute little purse that you can carry around and i'll tell you guys what i've received so many compliments on this baby and everyone's like oh my god sarah like it just steps up your style just a little bit and it makes a huge difference. So any kind of accessory really I would suggest. Ooh, while we're talking about accessories, let's bring it back to the 90s here real quick. I used to wear these all the time when I was younger and I kind of got away from it and now I got back to them and that's scrunchies, scrunchies. I love scrunchies. I have so freaking many of them and I just like to match them with my outfits especially when I'm going to the gym because I have so many gym clothes and if you have the wrong color it just throws them off and these are awesome because one again super cheap and you can wear them in so many ways I often wear my hair in a side braid sometimes two braids or I really like a high ponytail but it's not the best for your hair so I'm trying to stay away from it you know what I mean try to get some scrunchies I think this whole thing I have so many right here I can't even <laughs> pick them all up at once but I, there must be like 50 here and I got them for like 10 bucks on Amazon. Actually, if you go down in the description below, I have my little Amazon link, and there you can find a lot of the products that I buy on Amazon, and it'll give you a straight link right there to it. So I'll make sure that, that these are on there if you're interested, but I highly suggest it. A little, get a little spunk, a little spunk in your outfit. <laughs> Another thing that makes me feel very feminine is sparkles and glitter and I know you men out there are like rolling your eyes because you think glitter gets everywhere but that's why it's so great that's why glitter is amazing and I found this lotion it's from Bath and Body Works it's into the night and it is so glittery I like when you open it it doesn't even look like it's glittery but it is and it smells amazing and it's like this mm, it's like this thick lotion and I don't wear it every day I wear a regular lotion almost every day but I don't wear this every day because it is so thick and because like it is very glittery and then sometimes I feel like I'm being just a smidge too extra for just a regular day <laughs> the next product I recently found that I absolutely fell in love with was this eyelash primer Again, not a huge fashionista, not a huge makeup person, not a huge hair person. Literally, wash my hair, let it air dry, don't do anything. <clears throat> do the same makeup routine almost every day unless I'm doing something special. And this is something I recently started incorporating into my daily routine. Super simple, all you do is put it on 
Well, what I'll do is I'll put my use my little eyelash curler, little eyelash wand. Same as the mascara thing. All you do is you put it on. I don't put it on my bottom lashes because I don't know. I just think that's weird, and you don't. I don't. I don't need some like crazy ass dramatic <laughs> bottom eyelashes. But you just put it on, let it dry for maybe like 30 seconds, get a little tacky, and then immediately put on your regular mascara, and you're good to go. And the last divine feminine product I want to share with you guys is also a new product that I tried. So obviously sunscreen is very important. I'm not going to go into all that. We all know that if we want young, elastic skin, that wearing sunscreen is a non-negotiable. Now that being said, I freaking hate sunscreen. I hate sunscreen, especially on my face. It always has like a white hue to it or it's thick or it makes your makeup look weird. And I've just tried so many face sunscreens and I just hate them all until, until your girl Rihanna. So this is the Fenty Skin Face Lotion with SPF in it. I believe it's 30. I'm not positive though, it might be 15. It smells amazing. I would say it probably smells kind of like one of those Victoria's Secret scents, but I don't I don't have very, very sensitive skin. Like if you're sensitive to scents and you this might not be the product for you. But for me, it's it's lightweight, it doesn't feel thick, it leaves no white residue, whether I put it on right after I get out of the shower or on top of my makeup. Typically I do it before I even put my uh, face makeup on. But I love this stuff. It has been a game changer for me. And in the past, I've really been reluctant to put on sunscreen on my face because of all of those things. And now I actually kind of look forward to it because it smells so amazing. <laughs> So that's all I have for you guys today. I hope at least it gave you some inspiration of things that you can try for you to feel more feminine, for you to just feel more girly and in your flow and relaxed because we deserve that. We deserve to be in tune with our natural state and our natural yang, even though we all have the yin and yang. This video is about that yang. <laughs> so if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I love you guys so much and don't forget, be limitlessly yourself.